Hello everybody, my name is Kevin, and today we are going to review this, the Harry Potter Aragog's Lair. I'm gonna get Iris! So, this guy always keeps ruining my reviews and he has to continue to do that. If only, yeah, yeah, yeah. If only there was a spell to stop you, but yeah. So, yeah, so we're gonna talk about uh, Aragog's Lair, and this is obviously... You're ruining my review. <laughs> One day we'll have Eric reviews where he ruins everything. But right now, but we're gonna. Okay, now we may forget. But anyway, this is Lego's Harry Potter Aragog's Lair, as I just said, and this is around twelve dollars actually, which is really cheap. And this is obviously takes. This is obviously from the Chamber of Secrets, the second Harry Potter movie, and my brother's favorite. Harry Potter movie. I like it as well. It's a really good movie. And this is obviously where they look for Aragog for answers on the Chamber of Secrets and all that. So, as you see here, it's Harry and Ron and spiders. So, if you have a phobia of spiders, then you'll probably not like this. But, yep, this is the set. I really like this. This is a prequel cool set. Now I'm opening it because why not? All right, so I'm opening this set and oh, this is one big bag for a small set like this. Then again, all right, so. This is the set now. I have like three bags. And this is a pretty small instructions, but. Yeah, so now we're gonna build uh, the set and then I'll give you my thoughts and what I think of this set, so. Speed build. Hi everybody, so I'm back, and I have to say, also, don't mind the cutting the uh, grass right now, which is pretty annoying, but yeah, so now let's review Aragog's Lair, and I have to say, it took like, I think, less than 30 minutes, I think 10 or, I think the t amount of time that this set was built was like 10 or 15 minutes, because it's not that hard to build, or maybe with the, the legs, Maybe with the spider, it could take like 30 minutes. The other sets that I built, like the, like the Whomping Will set, it was like almost two hours. And Jurassic Park set was like an hour. But yeah, so we're gonna review this set and uh, we're gonna start with the figures. Oh, oops, sorry. This is Harry Potter. His face is the same from like the Whomping Willow. Happy face. Scared face. Also, I'm pretty sure. Can you see the scar? The scar's like right there. He he comes with a wand and uh, you know a candle, and he's in this scared face. But this is the face I like. Ron Weasley. And also, I'd like to mention these are these are different outfits. This is different from uh, the Whomping Willow set. And I really like this. I really like Ron Weasley here in the set because, because, uh, oops, sorry, that was, that was the lawnmower, but yeah, I really like this face because this, this reminds me of the scene where when the spiders are about to attack Harry and Ron, he's just like, can't we panic now? That's the perfect face for it. He also gets a lamp and a wand and also, uh, you know, same face from Whomping Willow. These are different outfits, like I said, but you see these outfits again in the in the Hogwarts Express, and I have a bone to pick with that set when I get there, but uh, but uh, until then, you know, we'll, we're talking about this set, although I do like that set. Eric, get out of the view. 
Okay, so uh, right now, now we're going to start with Aragog. Aragog! Okay, so this is Aragog, and uh, I really like this spider. I really do. This is pretty cool spider, although I think some of you who are scared of spiders probably won't like him, but this looks pretty cool, actually. It's kind of like a tarantula, kind of. But I kind of feel like pranking one of my friends, uh, Kyle, because... He's scared of spiders. I kind of feel like if I go to his house, I should like pretend there's a spider in his room or something. Oh, spider house. Why don't I edit these videos? Uh, anyway, <laughs> so yeah, so can you stop interrupting this review? <laughs> yeah, eventually I will have to edit these videos, but. Yeah, this is Aragog, and I really like it. It's pretty cool. I really like it, and I see that Eric. And, yeah. So, we're gonna set it aside. Oh yeah, also, this, I remember these. Like, if, you, if you're a Harry Potter fan, and if you watched all the movies, you might remember when Harry drank a luck potion in the Half-Blood Prince, when they were talking about Aragog and how scary he was. They're like, and people are afraid of the pincers. I remember that. I don't know if, I wonder if a Harry Potter fan got that, you know, that remembered that. But yep, yeah, now we're gonna talk about this set and there's not much to talk about actually. First off, you get lots of spiders. You get like lots of spiders. You get a total of five spiders. You get some grass, you know, this. This kind of reminds me of the Forbidden Forest that came out in like 2011, I think. You know, it's where, the Forbidden Forest, where they had, you know, similar to this, it had tr a tree, but there was a trap here, and it had Hagrid, Harry, and pretty sure, pretty sure Draco's mom as well, but that's it. So yeah, there's a s spider web here, here. Not much, I do like the tree. I like, I like what they did with the tree here. Kinda wish, maybe they should have made another one, maybe. But here's the main feature of the set. Oh, it just shot toward the screen. Anyway, that's like a spider web and... Oops. Oh, jeez. Wow. So that's all you do, you, uh... I'm gonna fire this at your troops right now. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, so, that's, that's the set. That's all there is to... I'm going to destroy this now. Oh no, I'll do it later. But yeah, after I was rudely interrupted by... I needed one for a second. Nope. Give me the one. Give me the... Why? Give me the one. I'm reviewing right now. Do it later. Uh, no, I just want to see the one. Excuse me for a second. Oh, so, yeah. After I sorted that all out. Um, final thoughts. So, after Eric made this 20 minutes longer, um, I have to say, I like this set. I really like Aragog. This is a pretty cool set. And if you're a Harry Potter fan, you'll probably like this. Now, if you're a Lego set fan, uh, you're probably gonna be like, nah, I don't wanna, I don't wanna buy it. And I can understand if you don't really wanna buy it. There's really not much to this set except, you know, it, it looks a little cool and, you know, you only get to flick fire missile one thing. Maybe they should have added a feature where you could like, you know, you can like have a catapult and launch all the spiders or something. That would have been probably much cooler, but Besides that, I, oh, whoops. Besides that, though, I really do like this set. This is a pretty cool set. And I, since I'm a Harry Potter fan, I do like this set. I like Ron and Harry. I do like Aragog, and I do like this set. Now, what am I gonna give this set? So I did some thinking. This set, like I said, there's spiders and stuff. I, although, I'm tempted to give it an A minus, but because it's like $12, it isn't like 15 or 20. 
And you do get Aragog, Harry and Ron, and you do get lots of new spiders. I forgot to mention, these spiders are, sorry, I had to take a piece off, but these spiders are pretty new. They're like different from the old Lego spiders. I think my final verdict on this set, oh, geez, trying to put this piece in, it's pretty hard. For some reason it won't stay in. Oh, it's that piece there, that's why. Yeah, that's why. Sorry about that. But anyway, my final verdict, uh, A plus still. Like, despite the fact that this probably has nothing to it, the pricing is good. All the Lego Harry Potter sets are good in price. And you do get Harry and Ron, which is pretty cool. You do get Aragog, you know. And I do like the Chamber of Secrets movie, and with all that, this still gets an A+. Plus. We continue the trend of A+, plus here. So how many sets has that been A+, plus in a row now? There's... I think that's four sets, yeah. Those are four sets, so... I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to review the Hogwarts Express, because I have that now. And, uh, I'm also going to make a, you know, Lego, like, Harry Potter, Sorcerer's Stone set ideas that Lego could make. Um, that's probably going to come out somewhere around this week. And for my stop stories, I'm sorry that I haven't been able to make a stop story yet if someone's kind of interested in that. Because school's going on and, you know, that's how it works. I've, you know, homework and stuff and I've been a little busy, so... Yeah, but I'm going to try to have some stop motion ideas. I put one stop motion idea so far, and I'm going to try to think of a stop story. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this review, and uh, yeah, so I'll see you later.